What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. <clears throat> this is titled "When the Maintenance Man When When Maintenance Crew Cleans Out Your Apartment Before You Moved Out." Let's get it. On May 22, 2024, a bizarre turn of events unfolded in a Chambly, Georgia, apartment complex. A man facing eviction made arrangements with the leasing office to peacefully vacate the premises before the official eviction date. He even had a friend retrieve his belongings while he worked out of town. However, when the friend arrived, he discovered the locks had been changed and he couldn't enter the apartment. The next day, the manager unlocked the apartment for the friend, revealing a shocking sight. The place was completely empty. The friend promptly FaceTimed the victim, who then contacted a neighbor with a ring doorbell camera. The doorbell footage provided crucial evidence. It clearly showed... You can skip through most of it towards the end, but this one pissed me off so bad. You can skip through. Most of it is towards the end. Three individuals entering the apartment and leaving with the victim's belongings. The victim, armed with this video, contacted the police. The officer who responded quickly identified the culprits, three members of the apartment's maintenance crew. Upon investigation, the officer... So you telling me the maintenance man robbed the nigga? That's what you telling me, y'all? Officer discovered a troubling pattern. So what? <laughs> what time stamp should I start at, friend? Doing all right. How you doing? Okay. okay. Perfect. Hello. Hello. Yes. Are you Miss Jones? Yes. Perfect. Are we able to have a Please, meeting yeah. in the office? Come in here. It's a little messy. I'm pretty sure you know why we're here, mm -hmm. why he called. Mm -hmm. um, I guess, well, I should, I mean, it's his stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. I spoke to you, and I spoke to you last week, and you mm -hmm. told me that you would unlock the unit for me to come retrieve my things mm -hmm. on Friday. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not actually it was supposed to be Saturday, but she called and told me she was going to come Friday. She, she said she was going to come on Sunday. No, no, no. Um, I have to. The messages from our, our, our... Skip towards the end. You got to give me a timestamp. Email. Mm -hmm. uh, so I have the recording of the conversation that when she called you and mm -hmm. told me she was 30 minutes away. Mm -hmm. But she got caught up in traffic. So she mm -hmm. got here a little bit later. Mm -hmm. There's a video of you going to the door, unlocking mm -hmm. the door, and looking mm -hmm. around inside. Mm -hmm. Then after you, then you contacted me again. You told me all my belongings were still inside the unit. That's correct. Right? Okay. After that video... There's a video of her going to the door, the door being locked. Mm -hmm. At around 10 something, mm -hmm. the maintenance man goes inside and starts getting <laughs> more belongings. Mm -hmm. prior I'm like to talking about just watching I'm invested. Mm -hmm. Friday at 3.44 p.m., they mm -hmm. had already started stealing things. And Thursday and Wednesday prior. So I have a video of you also going inside this past week. Mm -hmm. You went inside, stepped inside, and you were in there for about 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. So you know the belongings that were already inside. Mm -hmm. So when you mm -hmm. went back, you know what was in there also. Mm -hmm. That's so right. That, that's where we're at right now. No, that's correct. Um, and you said you would bring the video so that I could see it and confirm who was what, who did what, yes, so that I can address the proper people. So do you have that? Uh, I had the video, but okay. I was told by... Um, yeah, I told them um, right now it's a criminal investigation. Mm -hmm. So the video won't be shared right now. Okay, well, time. how can I help others? Um, so I guess, and I've asked him, but I'm going to start from the basic of building a case like this, right? Mm -hmm. So, to confirm with you, mm -hmm. was Mr. Black evicted from his unit? No. So he was not evicted? No, not yet. Okay. Were there any maintenance orders that were put in that people were supposed to be inside the unit? No, sir. Okay. Um, how many maintenance people do you have on site? Three. Three. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you happen to have the names of those gentlemen? I do, yes. Are you able to provide that? Absolutely. You need their names, that's it? Names and birthdays if you have them. I could 
could probably find those birthdays for you. It should be in our system somewhere. Okay. Um, I'll have to go from my laptop. That's fine. I'm not in a Imagine losing all three maintenance men because these niggas want to steal. Give me one second. Would you like their positions or that? Oh, oh that, that, yes, if that's possible. Okay, cool. Is the unit locked up now? Does your key still work to the unit? Do you know? Mm -hmm. Are we able to walk over to the unit just to. Yeah. I could take some photos and yeah. stuff. Um, the only thing that was removed after the last time that we spoke was whatever that young lady took in the bag, and that was it. The officer accompanied the... It's definitely given she knew what happened. ...the victim back to the apartment to investigate further. And then left certain shit. So like y'all can't even say like, oh, I thought we were supposed to clean it out or nothing. That's crazy. It's on the floor. It's on food. Like, what kind of low budget stuff? It's on the food. The TV was mounted? Yeah. I came and got the, I had her get the Xfinity box. Yeah. The Xfinity box was sitting up here behind the TV. Okay. They threw it on the floor. I had my stove too. Like, not no cheap stove, but my stove. It's a lot more tempting with it. I'm sorry, boy. That's been tempting with it. You can't. It, it, it don't matter. You can only lock it from the inside. Yeah. She left it. She knows. Uh, we'll walk up to the leasing office though now. Right, I was gonna say, I like how it is when you walk in and you can step up on the thing. I like that. And so, just to clarify, you do want to press charges, right? Like you want people oh, arrested. Yes. Okay. All right. So I make sure. Right. You know, sometimes people say that and they don't realize nah, really. nah. what it means. I work too hard for my stuff. No, let's, I feel you. I'm just, I'm just doing my dot my eyes, crossing my T's. That's all. Because I'd be, I mean, you can you handling on this uh, very well. Mm -hmm. I said you're handling it very well because I can't. My dad told me stay calm. Like, that's how he kept telling me. He been telling me that for three days straight. Stay calm about the situation. He said because in the end, right is right and wrong is wrong. I'm suing everybody. Was that everybody dumpster full go. three days ago? Or you don't know. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> okay. He's, uh, hell yeah, I want to, yeah. What we got to do? Shit. We can't lock the unit back. Okay, I got you. Okay, I got you. Blaze, I was thinking the same thing. He got on cool grays. They clean as hell. They took all his shoes. Run me my whole bag. Everything. You. Get I was to talking to you. I'm sorry. I'll see you in, I'll see you in 20. Okay. Okay. Bye. I'm pressing charges on them and suing the apartment complex. But it's got some more information. Because that's how I'm going to get my money. Okay. Um, one of those people on that list did admit to taking the items. Which, which gentleman is that? The last one, David. Is he still here? Yep. Can I speak to him? Absolutely. Let me call him back. Can I ask a question? Yeah. Yeah. He, he signed, he started out of a long All he said was two things. That's all he said. I think it was the couch and the bed. That's all he said. He did not say anything else. 
Okay. Um, meet me at the office. Okay. He's on his way. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. I'm gonna talk with him. Inside. I can talk to him outside. Okay, okay. It's okay. Let me go check out what's going on over here. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead lock You can just have a seat in the car. All right, I'm gonna uh, talk with him, and then we're gonna go from there. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. And the other one, we just went to the other one. David got to take the rap for all of us. I know, I know, but. I'm gonna sit in my car and turn my air on. Just, you know what I'm saying? You got it. Y'all let me, we here now, so you gotta let me. Gotcha. It's like training day. You ever seen the movie Training Day? Yeah. It's not what you know. Yeah. What you can prove. So we gotta, we gotta handle it like that. Cause right now we know a lot, but we gotta. A lot more than they think. The first suspect admitted to taking the sofa and bed, claiming a misunderstanding with the manager. Huh? He believed the eviction had already happened and offered to return the items. Yes, sir. Is How you doing? So he's it. <laughs> so he trying to say that he thought that he was being evicted. So he just felt like it was free reign anyway. Now that would have been a good story had y'all not left the rest of the shit in the apartment. Did y'all think like, are we just going to clean that later or something? No, she's uh, down there locking up the unit. Are oh, you David? Yes, I'm here. All right, perfect. I'm Officer Black. How you doing? City of Shambly. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, before we go any further, I'm going to read you something, okay? Everybody seen it on TV. Everybody probably knows it, but I got to read it to you, okay? What's this before you read it to me? This is your Miranda warning. Let me, let me just explain what's up. Uh, it was you, just a miscommunication. You going to jail, gang? Okay. okay. I was told the wrong information. I got you, but before... You know when that when them Miranda rights coming out, you know you're going to jail. We dive into that. Let me read this to you, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to speak to an attorney and to have an attorney present during any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you at government expense. Knowing and understanding your rights as I have, as I have explained them to you, are you willing to answer any questions without an attorney present? I can. Okay, so that's a yes? Yes. All right, so you said there was some miscommunication yes. going on? Yes. Tell me about that. Okay. What's the miscommunication? I don't, I'm not, I don't want to throw everybody under the bus. That's fine. He about I'm to snitch on everybody. Uh, a follower of many things, but we got the message that it was going to be an eviction for today. I was okay. told to go ahead by my supervisor, Sammy. Let's go get it, take it out, hurry up before it hit the curb. So. Here okay. something where I can get. Everybody got stuff, not just me. But okay. I have the stuff. If you want it back or if you want to sell it to me, we can do something. But okay. if you want it back, I'll give it back. No I problem. got you. And does Sammy work on site here too, or is he off yes, site? He's at the pool right now. Okay. That is Nick at the pool. Yeah. All right. Jamar, get his ass. Make it both making this text. But me and Sammy went up there. I broke the sofa down. I got it in my crib. I live on property, but I just don't want him to know where I live. I got you. No, I got you. Well, that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Uh, you don't want him to know where you live because you don't want the kid. I work here. I just did good furniture, good, good stuff. And you were told it was going to be an eviction. Yes. And so before it hit the curve. She sent the message out. He's seen good furniture and good stuff. He's all eviction. Can y'all imagine? Y'all know that nigga been chilling on his furniture. Done. Cracked open a beer and everything. Just good, 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 good. I'm good, 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 good. Foots up and everything on my shit. That's why I could have said, I'm about to go get in the car. <laughs> Cut my air on and chill. Okay. It's for Monday. We went in there Friday. So I got called you. my brother. He got a truck. Me and my 13 year old son. We moved everything from you the You even snitching on the son? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what it went. Okay. Oh. I got you. I'm oh, you know my child. Miscommunication. Yeah, and I was going to talk to the, my man, but he was right here. I yeah, nah, 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 you did, nah, nah, you did the right thing. You did the right thing. You have your ID on you by yes, chance? Yes, I do. This is, this is bad, man. Well, in a sense, I'm going to tell you it is. I know. And the reason why, and I'm, I, I'm just a straight shooter. 
Like, I, I, I don't like to soften blows. I like people to just know what's going Please. on. Um, the reason why it's bad is because he was coming to get his stuff. Came to pick up his stuff on Saturday, and everything's gone. Um, and so you imagine, you know, it's, it's like right, you, you right. come home, right? and somebody went and took your stuff. Um, I just got the bedroom set and the sofa. Okay. And uh, my son liked a photograph, a positive, you're black, you're motivated, you know, that type. So you said bedroom set and sofa. And sofa. Does the bedroom set include the um, nightstands? Yes. Okay. And that's all I grabbed. Headboard, matches, box spring, rails, two nightstands. Okay. Um, like I said, I just know how to be blunt. Yeah. Right now, it's, it's burglary. Right, but we all um, grab. We all grab. Oh, no. We oh. got video. Oh. Okay. <laughs> we got video. Okay. So everybody, everybody face on it? Clear as day. Locks showing, swinging, and everything. This nigga so, the snitch. <laughs> Yeah, it, it's, it's made his team messed up. everybody. I'm not surprised. Um, and so now that I have that piece of information, because I'm a, again, I'm just a straight shooter. So I'm gonna tell I'm you. Straight shooter too. If, if she would have, I would have talked to her. I would tell her. I don't lie. So, I so jeopardize my job. And if it's jeopardized. With, with this piece of information, right? I'm not trying to lose his job. You already about to lose it, man. It changes some things. The job gone as hell. Um. Because it changes some things with the aspect of orders and who was given. Because without this information with, you know, saying, hey, we got the eviction notices. We were clearing them out, whatever. Um, all three of y'all were going to get a warrant. It was going to be just straight, straight like that. And then I was going to come back here later today with a van. And everybody going to get in a van. And everybody going to go to DeKalb County. Damn. I'm just, it, I'm just being honest with you. Um, but that piece of information, it changes some stuff. So now I need to go talk to, you said Sammy is the supervisor? Yes. And he's by the pool right now? Pool. What does Sammy look like? He's black male black or? Uh, slim guy. Go on, uh, last slam for Sammy Sam. With locks. Oh, okay, he's the one with locks. Who lives here? Javar Golden, the one is thick. I oh, ain't gonna lie with a snitch too. Shit. The problem is, like they all would have had to stick to the story, and that's why you don't do stuff with other people. <laughs> like, oh my god. And then these niggas ain't even they twenties. I was about to say something about twenties. It don't even matter. He looked definitely forty plus. Yeah. Yeah. You see him? Uh huh. So he talked to the man first and told her whatever he told her. I just said, I don't know. Look, man, I'm, I'm older than everybody out here. I'm 43. I'm out of time. I got family, man. Look. Are they doing maintenance on the pool right now, or? They probably trying to stay out of dogs, man. I'm probably going to be fall guy, but I ain't trying to be. But nah, yeah, I, I, don't, I, don't do I don't do I, fall I guys. This, I don't do fall guys. I do the whole team, or I do the one that right. I got the best case on. I'm just telling you straight up. The one in the league, he's by the door. That's, that's yep, I'm going to go talk with him. I ain't make no move without no permission. That's all I'm saying. But I don't talk with me. I appreciate it. I really uh, do. I apologize. Like I said, it changes some things. Thank you. Mm -hmm. The second suspect, the crew supervisor, denied taking anything but trash. You. Is your name Sammy? It is. Can we talk? Here. You mind talking with me? Yes, sir. All right. So I'm gonna got... read you something too, like I read everybody else. But you read me first. Your Miranda warnings. Go ahead. We'll go from there. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to speak to an attorney and to have an attorney present during any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you at government expense. Knowing and understanding your rights as I have explained them to you, are you willing to answer any questions without an attorney present? Speak press 
Okay. okay. All right. So, like I told everybody else, man, I'm just a straight shooter. I'm going to just tell you how it is, uh -huh. okay? We have a tenant here uh -huh. that was, I guess, put Hell on no. an eviction. Hey, joy and journey. I wouldn't want none of that. <clears throat> Can you imagine what go what went on on my couch when I wasn't present? And not only that, it went from my nice apartment to his whatever apartment. Since you had to steal it, I know you got a raggedy apartment. So you done took my couch and my bed to your ragged ass apartment. I don't want it. I don't want it. <laughs> I'm suing all y'all for 200000 Okay? <laughs> I don't want none of that shit. I can only imagine. Ugh. I can only imagine. I don't want it at all. He's supposed to be getting evicted. Uh -huh. um, he was told by property management that he'll have the weekend to retrieve his property from out the apartment. Okay. Over the course of the weekend, you and some other employees were seen entering him into his unit and grabbing his belongings. So, uh -huh. I didn't grab anything out of the unit as far as his belongings, but it was trash. The other than that, I did not take anything. Okay. Out of what, was trash, trash, what was trash? Trash as far as like the, the perishable, the food that he left out uh -huh. that was just sitting right there. That was it. But okay. besides it. Okay. Was there an eviction notice or? It was yeah. a, so I was off for a couple of days last week. Okay. So when I got back that Friday, um, received a message, went up there, peeped my head in, bugs, gnats, et cetera, trash. I don't touch stuff when it comes to eviction like that. It was trash all up in there. That's cap. Their personal property. Okay. But no, sir, I didn't do that. Okay. Now, again, I state, all I had took out was some trash. Okay. Besides that, I don't have any of his any of his belongings at all. Okay. Is it normal to go in apartments when there's an eviction notice coming out, like to so, pick your head in? So. Yes, it's normal for me to walk the units. Okay. But far as like just going into the units, like nah. But trash wise, far as refrigerator. Sammy, y'all took everything. Traders, yeah. stoves, appliances. Where are my Jordans? Appliances, stuff like that. Yes, but besides that. Where are all my Jordans? Yeah, no sir. Okay. All right. Um, my dunks. Retro. Where? Where the drivers got? Where are my shoes? Where it, where is my computer set up? You know I got now now I got shit that 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 I got extra shit. Where my computer set up? That's something maybe the ring didn't get. You know, my camera, my Sony A7. Where's that? All the tripods I had. All right. Uh my Samsung and my LG TV. My 50. My uh, excuse me. My 75 inches. What at? My Apple headphones, AirPod Maxes. What did you tell anybody else that they can go? I like, give permission to go into the unit and oh, no, sir. take belongings or anything like that. No sir, why would I do that? Okay, I, people do different things, man. I no, I don't sir. try to understand the human mind. Um, Touche. But definitely no. Do you know if anybody else went into the unit and grabbed so, items? From what was told to me. Okay. Told to you when you was there? It was happening at 11 o'clock at night or whatever time of, whatever it was. Mm -hmm. But as far as me physically seeing anybody, no, sorry, I didn't. So I can't say, hey, I seen X, Y, and Z because I didn't see X, Y, and Z. Gotcha. Do you have you your ID there. on you? Yeah, I do. Okay. Perfect. And then you said all you took was trash out the this trash perishable perishables. Nothing worth value. Nothing worth value. Because you had anything. gnats and bugs and stuff yeah, like that. Nothing going worth value. It wasn't look at me. Like it wasn't nothing it I wasn't you. nothing in there. Just to confirm, you Nigga didn't said, tell look anybody at me. What else. No, Y'all can go in the room and no, or the apartment and no, sir. have at it. No, sir. All right. So, 
Like I've been telling everybody else, right now, it's being investigated as a burglary case. Okay? Mm -hmm. um, because even if they sent out an eviction saying, or a letter saying, hey, we're going to start the eviction process on these units, mm -hmm. you still got to go through the process before belongings get transferred out the, right. the unit. Right. Um, when you start the process, that's when you can change the locks. Right. Deny them access or right. unsupervised access. They, 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 um, yeah. And so, mm -hmm. you know, it's, it's like anybody, man. You come home and all your shit gone, you'd be upset. Yeah. yeah. And so that's 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 what is that's what it is right now. Right. As um, it should be. So, I'm just trying to piece some stuff together. Right. But that's 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 mind boggling. So some another adult could say, I said, Hey, go have it. Like no. That I'm not saying that. I'm just. I was told you were the supervisor. I, I am. But so, at the same time, I got a lot hanging over my head just because of the how title. I look. Yes, and my title. You. So, yeah, no. All right. Sir, would you mind talking with me? Sure. All right, cool. I'm going to read you something. I read it to Sammy. I read it to everybody. Let's protect you and make sure I'm doing my job correctly. Yes, sir. All right, it's just your, it's your Miranda warnings. Have you ever seen any kind of cop show, TV show? Uh-huh, they you know? always go to jail when you read the Miranda. You heard it, but I got to read it all the way through, okay? Right. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to speak to an attorney and to have an attorney present during any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you at government expense. Knowing and understanding your rights as I have explained them to you, are you willing to answer any questions without an attorney present? Go ahead, Ben. Yeah, I'm good. Right yeah, I'm good. Appreciate it. Sure, why not? Okay, perfect. So, I'm not, I don't like to assume anything, so I'm gonna just tell you why I'm even asking. Step over here and shave, man. It's a little hot, man, I appreciate that. Come over here. The third suspect, despite being caught on camera carrying a TV, insisted he only changed the locks and checked the unit's condition. So, what I'm investigating right now is essentially a burglary, right? right sir. Certain things have come to light during the course of me asking people what happened. But the original complaint is, a gentleman was called, said, hey, we're going to start the eviction process, mm -hmm. but we'll allow you to get your stuff out. Right. He set up to get his belongings out. Right. And while doing so, well, before the person was able to come and grab his belongings, his belongings were taken from his apartment. Right. Okay. There is surveillance footage that does show every maintenance personnel on his property entering that apartment and leaving with something. Mm -hmm. Including you, nigga. So I'm gonna start with you from the basic. You know, did you enter the apartment? I'm saying uh, it's procedure. Okay, what's you the know, procedure? You know, to go in there, you know, uh, trash out, you know, uh, you know, do maintenance requests and okay. you know stuff like was that. Was there a maintenance request? No, I'm saying. Uh, well, you know, it was a main request, you know, to change the lock or whatever at the time. Okay. And, you know, it was a uh, main request, you know, to go out there, uh, you know, see what was going on out there, you know. I mean, he guilty as hell, ain't he? Like, he's so guilty, he can't even really talk like that. Uh, sir, you snitching on, uh, you snitching without snitching. You know, for trashing out process and stuff like that. Okay, I got you. So, was that it? Just a maintenance request for the, the change of the locks and to the, and the check the condition of the unit. Right. Was there anything that was requested to take the items from the unit? No. Okay. Oh my God. Did you take any items from the unit? No. Oh sure? my God. Sure. No. No, you didn't or no, you're not no, sure? No, sir, I did not. Okay. All right. So, it, you on camera? I'm quite sure I'm here. You know what I'm saying? You but, know? but but taking stuff. I don't, I don't see how that could be possible. Cause I don't got nothing in my possession. Said that I took anything. I was a black. Huh? Huh? I didn't say you still got it in your possession. Oh, no, I'm, just I'm saying, asking if you took it. Well, you know what I'm saying? Saying that I took something. I'm asking. No, I ain't took nothing. Okay. 
Right. You on camera. He said you on. I so, other, so the only reason why you went into the unit was change the locks and to check the status of the, the unit to see right. what the condition of the unit right. was. You ain't okay. take the TV. And there was no order for anything to be removed from the apartment. You no. didn't take anything. No, sir. Okay. You have your ID on you by chance? Yes, sir. Uh, stupid as hell. <laughs> I do. Perfect. All right. Thank you. All right. I got a question. Despite their justifications, the officer informed the victim he had located his bedroom set. However, the victim refused to take them back and wanted to press charges against all three individuals. Damn right. I don't want that bed. You know, nigga, he needed that bed. Probably got some cheeks soon as he got that bed. Boy, baby, I just put a new bed up. Boy, let me tell you something. Boy, let me get some of that. Hell no. And you just sitting in the bed when you get it back thinking about what happened. Uh-uh. No. Fuck no. <laughs> oh, and he got a nice car. So I got some good they news. They couldn't wait to uh, break in his apartment. Ooh, some bad news. Some news. What's, what's the good news? Good news. Bad news. Bad news is I'm getting three different conflicting stories, of course, yeah. to be expected. Good news, I found your bedroom set, your sofa, and your two nightstands. If you want them back. I don't want them back. Or if you want to sell them. That was the offer that I was proposed to me to offer to you. The only thing I could do is tell somebody, no. hey, I'll, I'll let them know, but I it's going to be up to him. I paid for a U-Haul truck. It was sitting for two days. That's money I lost. Yeah. Look, you, you don't gotta take it. Yeah. I just, I'm a man of my word. So if you say, hey, tell them this and this, I'm gonna tell them and then it'll be up to them. Oh. Um, but I'm getting conflicting stories. I do have, the only thing that I do have is the minutes of each party entering into your unit. I don't care about that. We got to be here when I'm still in the state. Right. Yeah. So, I'm going to make some calls to CID, see how we want to go and proceed from here. As far as do they want to re-question them or if I have enough right now to just take in everybody. Um, as far as I know right now, you're good. If you want to hang out, you can. I'm going to hang out because I want to press charges. I'm not going to. I got you. I got you. I got you. Like I said, I'm just presenting you what I got right now. Yes, sir. That's it. Just the facts I was able to gather. Okay. Um, and we're going to go from there. So let me call CID, see what their input is, and then we'll do what we got to do. I hear it. After consulting with the supervisor, the officer decided to arrest the maintenance crew. Um, I'm about to put three into custody. Just want to give you a heads up. Let's do this. Let's, um, don't bring the van all the way in. Because it's the maintenance workers, and I don't want them to, uh, run. Kind of get spooked out. Because, yeah, you want me to meet you there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll meet you at the church, and then we'll come up to the front office, and then I'll have that lady call all the maintenance men back to the front office, and then we'll do what we got to do there. So, yeah, I'll meet you at the church across the street. All right, perfect. All right. One by one, the crew members were called into the leasing office and apprehended. Hello. I'm back again. Hi, I'm doing well. How about yourself? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Can we get all three to this office one at a time? Please? Do you Anybody care who goes first? You take your pick. Okay. 
in case somebody goes to jail today, can I have them take off their gray star uniforms so that they don't have mug shots with our company name? Oh. We can make that request. It just depends on how compliant they want to be because they are all are going to jail today. Okay. All three. Okay. Um, uh, don't let them know that. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Uh, if, if and when you notify them that they're going to be arrested, can we'll request at that time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yep. Thank you very much. Not a problem. Um, we we want to somehow get the residents' belongings back to him. Okay. Um. So I know where. Because I, I his heard bed. they want to get the, his stuff back because they don't want them. They don't want to get sued. You're getting sued. Okay, them, and they did. <laughs> oh, they did. I, I know where his bed. Because so as an far. employer, I had to open up that dialogue because we need to take action on our end as well. Yeah. So. Um, I know as far as his bed and sofa goes, he's like, I don't want that back. Because, okay. <laughs> you know. That's a bed and sofa. Right. Right. Um, fabrics. All I think the big. Uh, all that. Everything. The thing that he's really looking for is yeah. his MacBook. Okay. I know. Uh -huh. Which, okay. okay. Is MIA right now. Nice. Only one person confessed to me mm -hmm. and what they took. Gotcha. And so the stuff that they took, stuff that he doesn't really want back, but his MacBook right now. Yeah. And so he's working on actually logging into his Apple ID yeah. and tracking it. Do they yeah. have, because a ring camera had been mentioned, mm -hmm. do they have the video of who walked out with certain mm -hmm. items? It's just, okay. it was in a bag. And so it's oh, hard to say okay. Okay. who had the bag. But no, it, you see Claire's Day mattress, yeah, uh, TV, yeah, everything. Yeah. And David is coming. Okay. And what I'll actually do too is I'll give you my business card with the case number on it. And I'll give you my business card as well. That way, if you have any questions. Perfect. Damn, I have to do that a minute too. Give me my tech and my shoes back. Definitely want my shoes. <clears throat> um, and absolutely give me my MacBook. But the bed and the sofa can stay. Yeah, I'll put your hands behind your back for me, all right? Man. Yes, sir. So they're requesting that we take this shirt off. Do you have a shirt on underneath? I need to go change. I just got to take the tank top. Can I just go? Nah, you ain't got to worry about it. Palms together. All right, can I ask why I'm being arrested? Yes, sir. Just give me one second. I'm going to tell you exactly why. Why being arrested is great. No, sir. Right now, you're being placed on the rest for burglary. Sorry, did you say that again? Oh, you're being placed on the arrest for burglary. burglary. Yes, sir. Can I talk to the guy? Just explain to him that it wasn't my fault. I've done that, but he's past that point right now. He came home and all his stuff was gone. All right, do you have anything on you I need to know about? Weapons, knives. No. Okay. All right. Do me a favor. Go right up here. And then he stay in the complex, so he gonna get kicked out. Oh. And just, you can stand in here. <laughs> the cop cool as hell. <laughs> Shut yep. up, Blaze. <laughs> Thank you, sir. No. So he. Are you, I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. you no, you're fine. Are you putting in the incident report that the resident only wants a natural back? Um, I can, yeah. and yeah. I'll confirm with him okay. about what property he really wants to get back. Yeah. And then, the big thing that he mentioned when we were there was so his MacBook. I can ask him. Yeah, no, we would love. Mm -hmm. we want Once we get, great, you know, all this, bigger and then, because um, he's still outside. Okay. Okay. And so I'll let him. Okay. He's, he's been level-headed. 
given yeah, the circumstances. Yeah, I, I, I um, so agree. yeah, I'll I'll send him in and Let then him you guys can talk. In any way, shape, or form, we and try to make it right. However, best ladies, we shut up! You're getting sued. I hope we did. Can. Yeah, sounds good. Okay. You said call the next one. Mm-hmm. He's on his way. He didn't answer my phone calls. Though. Yep, I see him over there. All right. Give me a favor. Put James on you back. Yes, sir. Do you have a shirt on underneath? Yeah, let me take it off. All right, go ahead. Thank you, sir. Matter of fact, upgrade me to a three bedroom and no rent me for life. Oh. Okay. Oh. Nah, hell no, nah, I'll leave there too. Wait right there for me. He was leaving anyway. Do you have a shirt on underneath? No. You don't have a shirt on underneath? No. Alright. We can just palms together. I'll let you handle that. If I need you. Rotate. No, this way. There you go. Rotate your hand. There you go. Relax. I'm trying not to pinch you, bro, but you. There you go. Look. We'll get to that. I got you. He definitely couldn't come. I'm able to offer to call somebody for them if they want me to. Sure. Do you guys want me to call anybody? Oh, she's even being nice to them. Even in handcuffs, they pleaded with the officer. They asked him to speak with the victim, hoping to find a way out of arrest. What is it? What's name? I gotta confirm. I think it's a felony, though. What? Burglary. Come on, I don't have my phone. I'm using the car. Hmm? The victim wants to, not me. I, I, I did talk to him. I did. And he is too. What? What are you saying? Okay, so, so we'll do this. My partner left to go get the van. Once he get back here, I'll go talk with the bitch because he's still here, and and we'll, we'll go from there. All right. I got you. I ain't going over. I just got an English I got. I got my I'm not doing that. I'll. I'll. People were adamant. Like he really, because I mean, you got. Think you came home, all your shit gone. How would you feel? I, I ain't saying, but I don't keep up with our residents. No, no, I'm talking about your personal house. You came home with your stuff gone. You'd be mad. Yeah, but it's not a rip by the situation. Yeah. Right. But like I said, if that wasn't offered earlier. You know what I'm saying? When I spoke to everybody individually, nobody said, hey, let me talk to him. Let me try to. Yeah, yeah, yeah you did. And, but the thing was, you offered his bag. You don't want his bag back. It's already been gone in somebody else's house. Talk to the dude. Talk to the dude. So we can rectify it. I can only do one thing at a time. I'm sitting right here. Oh. I ain't going on. Got you. And then we go from there. All right, that'll be good. We can just get this stuff back with you, you know, in the prisons. So nothing, you know, I'll break out. Be quiet. Just a second. 
You want headphones? Just to make sure. I know. Okay. I don't know what he's saying. Hmm? It's just it. It's on him. He's a victim. I can't do no moves without the victim's can victim work. So you can't bring him in so we can talk to him. I can't bring him in here. No, I can't do that. But I can go talk to him. Yeah. Right. I can't. I can't just leave out in here. Well, cover. <laughs> no, man, it's liability, man. It's, it's, I, can't, I can't. I can't. <laughs> Not that way. It don't work that way. All right, Jay, I'm trying to get you to catch before he leaves. He not, oh, he not leaving. <laughs> oh, he not leaving, because he about to press charges against all you motherfuckers. He, not, he, 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 he been here for an hour, 30 something. I was just over here dope for him. He hit me that time. Sure. And he got down and put somebody out illegally, and he had me in some shit. So, and I'll, again, yeah. I, I, I know it's saying, like, talk to him. Talk to him. That's all I'm saying. I got you. Great right now. I, got I, you. Got to I, I, I don't got no more straps for, um, I can't get no more feelings. Like, my real clean. Like, I ain't no more first offender. Right. Yeah. They're telling me what you're trying to say about me. I'm starting to make sure you're telling me. Right. You're telling me. They trying hard as hell. And then pull him. He don't do nothing. And he just in trouble. Just I got you. So I'm to you break I you I got you. I you. I got you. I got you. I got you. I you. I got you. I you. I you. I got I you. I I I you are. You ain't quicker than this. You can't beat Monroe. Hmm? You can't beat Monroe. Exactly. Monroe is the man. I've been doing this for some time. Well, at least they can make light of the situation. I started young, man. I started doing this when I was real young. Yeah, I was going to be law enforcement when I was 19 at first. And I remember. Yeah, tell that man that. I got you. You know what I'm saying? I got you. Look, look, I wasn't presented this earlier. When I asked, when I talked to everybody individually, certain things were offered to be returned, but. Who, I, let me finish. But who want a bed back after somebody, another man has slept in it? Hello. He ain't slept in a bed for five months. But I'm saying, I offered, I said, hey, look, I got this and this found. There you go. Just stand by real quick. Nah, he I'll, be I'll be right back. This camera is behind. That's pissing me off. Huh? Can you see litigation? What you mean? Like a lawyer? It's a like civil suit? Yeah. I can. Yeah. What what I do to do that? Uh, you will contact a lawyer, mm -hmm. um, a yeah, civil lawyer. I don't know why this is behind. Temporary. Um, you see the front? This is, so the police department, you can go there, give them that case number, they can give you a copy of it. Or if you call that number, the front desk. I believe that they were emailing him during COVID. I think they might still be, okay. but I'm not 100% sure. He, he got a hell of a case, y'all. Okay. So I've been sent out here to try to talk to you by the gentleman inside, mm -hmm. by the maintenance crew. Mm -hmm. they, they want me to plead their case for you, to, for them, to you about, I listen, I, I know, but I'm okay. a man of my word. Like the same, same way, okay. you know what I'm saying? Vice versa. Um, they said they could get your stuff back. I'll give you your stuff back, but try to see if there's anything you'd be willing to do for them not to get arrested today. Sound good. I'm a man of my word. Well, that, remember I told you that earlier, right? Yeah. I like this cop, though. He even gave him a chance. If they ask me something, I, pre I present it to him. Same way if you would say, hey, look, just tell them I get my, my stuff back. Um, not you know, trying to find the best for your problem. But, it's an invasion of privacy. No, it's total disrespect. I don't expect yeah. you to take it. And I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just saying... They yeah, asked me to I do it. I'm gonna do it. Um, also, too, the regional manager's inside. 
she wants to know if you wanted to talk to them about anything or yeah, I do. okay I um, finished process, I'll talk to them. Uh, perfect Thank see you. we're catching on Thank you. Would y'all give him the chance? If it were y'all, would y'all have given him the chance? He not hearing me. He not. No. Why not? It's crazy. I feel like he was violated. That's what he said. It was an invasion of his privacy. <laughs> All right. And he will be in trouble. Take the walk of shame, getting the police van. Uh. Ultimately, all three suspects were charged with first degree burglary and transported to the DeKalb County Jail. You ready? Yeah. I'm going to give you a ride to my unit. Damn. Well, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. That was crazy. But I appreciate y'all for putting me on to that one. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.